Hi everyone, welcome and welcome back to Crystal Vision 1111. This is a general love reading for the collective. Not all of the messages that come through in this reading today will apply to everyone watching. So please only take in from this reading what speaks to your soul and what resonates for you and your situation and release the rest to the universe. Let's see what you need to know for your love reading today, guys. What does the collective need to know? I feel blessed to share this connection with you. Your person sees you as a blessing in their life. They see you as a gift from the universe. And that is exactly what you are. Now, they may have disrespected that gift and that blessing from the universe by acting out towards you, by treating you with bad behaviors, hurtful words, and all of the stuff that goes with that. But during this time that you've been apart, they have awakened. They see you as a blessing and they feel blessed to share this connection with you because your person understands now that there is a destiny in this connection with you and that you have to fulfill this destiny with each other. Your person sees you as a blessing. And while they may not have been able to honor this connection with you in the past, as they step forward to apologize and start rebuilding this connection with you, they will honor you, they will love you, and they will honor this connection as well. Let's see what else we need to know for this reading today, please. What does the collective need to know about this person? I am grateful for the gift of your love. Wow. Okay, guys, your person is waking up, and that is what happens during these times of separation. The universe comes along to shake us up and wake us up when it is time to change, and your person is changing. Now, they may be stubborn. They may have resisted this growth. They may not have wanted to grow up and find that emotional maturity and stability within themselves that is there. They just had to step into it. But they're doing it now. They appreciate you. They have gratitude for your unconditional love. But they also appreciate the fact that you are giving them this time and space that they need to work on their stuff. That they need to work on. To heal. To grow. To evolve. Because this is what is allowing them to say here that they feel blessed and that they are grateful. And soon they will say these words to you in person as the two of you start spending time together and start clearing the air with one another so that you can rebuild this relationship. Let's see what else we need to know for this reading today, please. What does the collective need to know about this person and this connection? Your love is everything to me. You know, your person is seriously... <laughs> having a, had a wake-up call here. They've had an epiphany. They have had a breakthrough. They can see the forest for the trees, and they get it now. Your love is everything to this person. You have loved them unconditionally through good times, through bad times, through hard times. You have been there. You have been this beacon of light and love for this person. And while they may not have expressed their love for you when you were spending time together before they most certainly will be expressing their love for you as you rebuild this relationship because the love that you have shown this person that you are willing to forgive them and accept them back into your life after what they have well, the way they treated you and the way they spoke to you by running, by ghosting, by denying the connection, whatever else your person has done here. It gives them a greater understanding of what unconditional love is and what universal law is, the law of cause and effect. So your person, when they return, they're going to be so grateful to you. They will shower you with affection. They will express their gratitude and they will show you through their words and actions, that they have changed, that they have grown, and that they have evolved into a better person who can be the partner that you need 
who can meet you halfway, who can show up for you, who will be there for you, who will love you. What else do we need to know for this reading today, please? What else does the collective need to know about this person and this connection? Our two hearts are meant to be together. Yes, your hearts are meant to be together, but your souls are meant to be together as well. One heart, one soul, this will be the union of the one with you. As the two of you come into union, you will see a merging of your souls because your two souls long to come together. They urge to merge. That is what this connection is all about. Your person knows that the two of you have a destiny to fulfill with each other. They know that there is a divine plan in place to bring the two of you into union. And before, they just weren't ready. But they've changed. They're different now. They are getting ready so that they can be the person who is worthy of your love. Let's see what else we need to know for this reading today, please. What does the collective need to know about this person and this connection? We share a love and a bond that is unique. Well, yes, you do. It is a very deep soul bond that you share with this person. It is a soul deep love and your person understands that now. They may have denied this connection in the past that it didn't exist or that it was all in your head. But they have had that clarity, they've had this epiphany, and they are acknowledging that this love that you have with each other is unique. It's something that's different than anything they have ever felt before. And it's probably very much the same way for you as well. What else do we need to know for this reading today, please? What do we need to know about this person and this connection? Loving you has made my heart fuller. Well, loving you has filled your person's heart with love. And they may not have shared that love with you expressively. They may not, may not have told you how they felt about you. But that will be different with your person as you rebuild this connection. Your person's heart is full of love for you, just like your heart is full of love for them. Because loving you is everything. You guys share a deep soul connection. They feel blessed to have you in their life. They're grateful for this gift of your love. And they say here that you belong together because you share a love and a bond that is unlike anything else they have ever experienced in their life. This is your reading for today, guys. Thank you all so much for watching and allowing us to share your journey. If you enjoyed this reading today, please take a moment to like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. We appreciate all of you so very much. Blessings of peace, love, and light to everyone watching. Have a great day, everyone.